were two important items that I inadvertently left out of uh, my part three video. One has to do with the electrical wiring and it is important that these resistors go in a certain order according to the instructions. So you can see I have them down here connected. There's two for this wiring set of the lowest level. It shows a total of six. The kit only included four but I simply went to my uh, local electronics store and these are very inexpensive. I took the originals in inside. The, I put it in an old case that I had and they matched up the size that it is and these were like a dollar forty nine and they'll do the same job and if you have the brown and black wires you want the positive wire going into the resistor it doesn't necessarily matter which way they face apparently I didn't know but that's what the electronic store told me it's just important I guess that it goes on the positive side if you're interested in the specifics of what I purchased to use they're one quarter watt by NTE it's uh, 10 ohms and the model number is QW010 the other issue that I failed to include is the difficulty I had getting this into position I discussed I wished I had made these larger but I came up with a technique to get this in place let me show you that short video clip to clarify how I got that into place. I saved some scrap. This is relatively thick and I was able to take and slowly using this little tap hammer and actually a large hammer and just gently tap this down. I used rubber bands to hold these in position a little bit better like I would gently tug. Now you have to be careful you don't want to break it but just to tug it so it would fit into the opening. The main thing I would say is absolutely take your time. This came in handy because I could lay it across this way and I could tap. And I do have it all the way down. Even with tapping this into place, that could get it down, but it could not get it far enough to the outside where these would match up. And that's important because this next piece has got to fit in here and match up just right so that these puzzle pieces can then come back out. So this is what I did and it has worked pretty well. I'm not quite done. But again, I took a piece of scrap and I can go across, take this clamp, and again, I will highlight gently tighten this and I've been able to push this deck all the way against those support members so it's looking uh, just right now so I can continue on